Hello everyone, my name is Sir Rikari, aka Sir Rikari. You can call me Sir Rikari, but I much prefer Sir Rikari. Anyway, with all that aside, welcome to my FTB Infinity Let's Play. Unfortunately, this is going to be the last of this Let's Play that I make. Uh, and the reason is because I don't have time. With work, I really haven't had much time to do any editing. I had a video in mind. In fact, I'm just, I, I guess I'm just doing it just now. I was going to make it a week ago. Um, however, I haven't really had time to make it. So, this is my failed attempt to make an FTB video. Fortunately enough for me, though, I will have time in the future because my schedule is changing. So it's going to be awesome. And I'm going to do more videos. But it's not going to be FTB. That's the other thing. I'm going to do FTB over Twitch instead. Um, but before I get to that, uh, the other thing is FTB doesn't really have a whole lot of excitement to it. Um, because there's just so much content to it. And you just you go around and you do a lot of mining and you do a lot of <clears throat> collecting and I mean that may be fun for maybe a twitch you know a stream but it's definitely not for a video I mean YouTube is really just about making videos that are fun you know full of action and not the boring stuff whereas the boring stuff is really good you know it's inevitable um, in the game and on twitch and, and I think that would be a better mixture for those two um, and so I'm just gonna try to skip doing a YouTube Let's Play of FTB. Um, however, I can do a highlights video uh, for that. I think that would be fun too. I think everybody would enjoy that, right? Right? I mean, you gotta enjoy it. It's, it's great, right? Uh, more points on that. Anyway, I'm still going to do Let's Plays on this channel. However, I'm gonna do different games. And they're mostly gonna be story games or just like fun multiplayer co-op games or things like that. Uh, I'm gonna do Undertale because it reminds me of Earthbound and I really loved Earthbound and it was one of my favorite games when I played, or rather when I played as a kid. By the way, I am quite old so <laughs> the 90s I had a lot of uh, Super NES games and Earthbound was one of them. It's also a pretty popular game, you know it's got a cult following so I think that I think that that would be a fun game. I mean, Undertale is really fun. I mean, according to a lot of people. I've only played, like, maybe five minutes of it, and I don't even understand what the hell's going on. But we're gonna figure that out. And it's also an indie game, and I kinda wanna get into indie games. I've been doing a lot of, like, AAA titles, and I shouldn't do that, because that's not a good idea. Not for video, not for fun. Not for fun, really. I mean, there's a lot of AAA titles that are great, but there's, a lot, there's also a lot of indie games that are interesting and fun and have good stories and they kind of sway away from all that BS that you get from AAA games which by the way I know Call of Duty Black Ops 3 just came out not gonna lie I'm not a Call of Duty fan I used to be a long time ago I stopped playing because it just got repetitive it was just boring to me I was just like it didn't retain that awesomeness that, that Counter-Strike did which is another topic of conversation anyway uh, Another game that I plan to play is No Man's Sky, when it comes out of course, and it looks amazing and I think a lot of people will really enjoy Let's Play that. I, uh, I haven't bought it yet, but I will, and I will definitely play it, and I think I'll enjoy it more than people will enjoy watching it, so. <laughs> I think honestly if you aren't getting the game and you just want to check it out, I really have to say that's a wise decision, but you're going to be bored. so. Um, I would definitely say pick it up if you can, if, if you want to, if you want to take that risk. A lot of the times when they when they show the gameplay and it looks really awesome, it's really because it is awesome. Um, anyway, uh, there's another game that's coming out that's called Tacoma. It hasn't come out yet. It's going to come out in 2016. And it's a, it looks like it's a puzzle game and a mystery game. And I like that kind of style. I like puzzle games and mystery games. If you don't already know, by the way, as far as the puzzle side goes, I really love Legend of Zelda. So I'm a huge fan of that series. And as far as mysteries go, I think my favorite title for a mystery game... Oh boy, there's a ton. I, I, I'm not going to go through it. I'll play eventually. Um, anyway, other indie games I may play. Um, I may actually play AAA games too. I, I don't really have a preference over, you know, one or the other. 
mean, they're all games, and I love playing games, so I think it'd be great to... Games, games, games. That's a lot of games I just said. Anyone could just uh, suggest a game if you've got a game that you think you uh, that, that you think I'd I'd enjoy. You could definitely suggest it to me. Just let me know what you want me to if you if you want me to play it. I'll definitely play it. I'll play big hits as well as diamonds in the rough, so to speak. Uh, you know, there's always that one gem that's that nobody really plays, but it's it's like an awesome game, and it just needs to be out there more. And I think that if more people play them on YouTube, I I know it's like an advertising kind of thing but you know when you really enjoy a game when you really enjoy it and you want to get it out there and get it known basically with a game that you really like you want a sequel to it something fun or just like additional content of course people who whose games or well developers whose games don't get recognized don't really make all that much money on those games so they just kind of you know, sway away from those, and it's probably, there. you know, a lot of the times when it comes to those games, there's just not a whole lot of coverage for those. There's not a whole lot of exposure for that game, and I think YouTube is a great medium for that kind of deal. So if I ever see a game that I think is amazing, and I want a sequel for it, or some kind of game that's very similar to it, I'm definitely going to stream it on, or uh, not stream it, but... Uh, record it for YouTube. Most games that will take an exorbitant amount of time will most likely be streamed by me instead of recorded for the use of the dudes. Uh, I'll put it uh, all over Twitch. Otherwise, short, fun multiplayer games will definitely be played by the one and only me. Uh, I could have said Zerikari, but I guess I've said it already. You know, I'm starting to sound like Mike Jones, you know? Or other rappers that I'll keep my I'll keep an eye out for potential fun games and possibly dip into the classics as well. I would love to have the level a let's play of Earthbound and maybe some other cl classics I can scrounge up on the Wii Shop or PlayStation Store. Heck, I may even do mobile games like Dungeon Hunter version 3686 or Ring Glory. In the meantime, I'm terribly sorry for the short video. I really hope to make this channel something rather enjoyable for friends and family, although I will warn you, I do not have a filter on my words and anything I may say in the video is purely because I wanted to say it and purely my opinion. So if I do end up swearing, I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. And if I say something that may offend you, if it's something that's like super offensive, I get it, but as far as certain topics that are on the news right now that I'm not particularly keen of, I'm also not sorry for those. I will say that uh, <laughs> I will defend my opinion. But anyway, my goal is to make this channel something of a home for me rather than an outlet, so I will keep most of my opinions to myself. Uh, I think it's safer that way for everybody involved. Um, that way anybody who's watching is actually here for the games and not for the topics of ridiculous conversation because it happens a lot we all know it it's all over the internet we all think it's crap anyway i look forward to enjoying games with you guys and i can't wait to make this channel a true gaming outlet for everybody um definitely come back and watch my videos thanks for watching have a good one